hey Carolyn here and I'm making this quick video on how to create your own gravatar or personal profile pic and the gravatar is used to follow you around when you go on the internet and you post on other people's blogs and so what we're going to do is we're going to create that gravatar for you so you go to gravatar.com and sign in and when you sign in you'll be taken to a page to either sign up for a new account or if you already have an account you can sign in because you can make all kinds of additional uh, add all kinds of additional information or make changes to your account so let's just create a new account or so you enter the email address that you are creating a gravatar for and you uh, really don't have to put choose a name a username if you want to it just will give you your email address and then create a password for it and sign up so once you sign up it will send you a confirmation email to the email address that you use and you go there to uh, confirm that you are you so you go inside and you activate your account now once you activate the account it will bring you back over to gravitar.com and where you will go and sign in as that email address that you just created so just click on sign into Gravatar and you're inside now and you can manage your account as you can see it's already set up with the email address that we use as your primary email address if you want to have different pictures for different email addresses then you can add a um, new email at any time and what we're going to do now is we're going to add the image the image can you can use any image you want you can get one that's already on your computer you can get one off the internet you can get one that you have already previously added if you want to switch between images or you can just take a picture right here point in time using your webcam if you have one so we're going to go to the computer and get an image you browse your files for images I am going to use something that uh, just any kind of image so once you've gotten a picture just click on next and it will take you to where you can need to crop the picture so you're going to crop the picture um, it'll give you um, some cropping you can change it if you want to I'm just using this kind, um, this is just a, a internet image, image I got from the internet. But if you have a picture of your face, then you may want to play with that until you get your face centered just right. But you crop the picture and click finished. So it will then take you to the crop picture and let you see what it looks like. Um, you it gives you the rating of PG um, you can put G there I put G there just that so, just so um, it consider everything and then you're back to your image so it shows you that it's pulled the image up already it's will use that um, as your primary image you just need to confirm it by clicking on the image and when you click on the image and confirm it, it is your profile image. And you're done. And so let's just go check our profile just to be on. And so when you get inside your profile, you will see that it does have your image um, next to your profile. So whenever you go out there and post on other people's blogs, this image will be with you. Carolyn here. Hope you have gotten some value from this video. Leave me comments and let me know what your thoughts are. 
and I will see you on the next video. Thank you. Bye.